Hey, it's Eddie Cruz for Trucking Masters. I haven't done a video again because it's been busy, um, but we're slowing down now, so I'm gonna take a time and actually um, and do another video. Now, last video that that I made was about the pre-trip, how to pass the pre-trip, how to see the pre-trip in a different way so you can understand the pre-trip, so that way you're not memorizing the pre-trip like that. So we talk about, you know, when you're inspecting a vehicle this big. 50,000 pounds, 50,000 pounds, 60,000 pounds, you have to make sure that you understand that, you know, inspecting the vehicle has to be in a different way than, you know, you inspect your, your car, your personal car. So, but this video is going to focus on maneuvers, backing up the vehicle. So, if you want to go in more deeper, I'm going to go in more deeper in future videos and stuff like that. And again, if you like my videos, go ahead and support it. Uh, description around here there's going to be a button that says uh, tutor and just you know join my patreon I'll do more videos about this so that way um, our training here you can actually use it in your school because remember it doesn't make a difference how bad the school is it doesn't make a difference how good the school is if you apply the principles that I'm giving you it doesn't make a difference what school you attend you will be successful all right so this video is about backing up now as you can see my students back here right there okay now our school takes a different philosophy on backing up we don't focus on the superficial which is left wheel right wheel left wheel right wheel we don't focus on that what I teach our students is how to be able to manipulate this what's going on okay this is what we teach our students how to do is control their mind control what they think about okay no what I mean by that is I was talking to a student earlier, and she has never driven a commercial vehicle before. And she was looking at, the, at another school, another student, and she was working out the angles in her mind. Now, I told her that the first level of creation, or let's go specific, if you want to do a maneuver, okay, with a commercial vehicle, you have to be able to produce the image in here, how, how exactly you want the vehicle to move. So move the vehicle in your mind. Next level is say it. How exactly do you want your vehicle to move? So first one is you think about it. You're outside the vehicle, you can see the vehicle. You, your first level of thought is imagine the vehicle moving as if you were driving it. Next level is tell me, tell me exactly, as an instructor, tell me exactly what exactly do you want that vehicle to do? So as she was thinking about it, she was telling me about it. Now I told her, now third level of creation is I want you to go do it. Most people reach the second level. They think about the truck moving. They know exactly what it should do, what they want the vehicle to do. Second level, they always know, okay, I got to pull up here, I got to pull up there. I want to do this, I want to do that. They can, they can say it. But most students do not reach the third level, which is actually doing it, okay? So first is thought. Work the angles in your mind. Work it out. Talk about it, say it. Tell the instructor or a different stu student exactly what is it that you want the vehicle to do. You can imagine whatever you want. And then when it's your turn to do it, you go ahead and do it. That's how you produce the results. So it's not about left wheel, right wheel, instructor can be walking next to your truck and tell you turn the wheel left and the wheel right. You're not doing anything by doing that. You know what left and right is. But when you get out the vehicle and you're seeing what needs to be done, you imagine yourself being behind the vehicle and doing the, ve the maneuver perfectly in your mind. And when you say it, you have that inspiration, that confidence. And then when you walk towards the vehicle, you produce what the image implies. And let me say it again. It doesn't make a difference what school you're in. Please apply these principles and I'm telling you the result is instantly. First level of creation, thought. You create the image in your mind of how you want the vehicle to move. By being outside the vehicle and move it, move it. Back of the trailer to the right, back of the trailer to the left. Produce the image. And then talk about it. I want the vehicle to do this. I want the vehicle to do that. And then when you go in there, you produce the image. You make it real. 
that's the reason why people in our schools do not, do not, do not fail. If you do fail, it's because you chose to do something different and that's something that we can't help. Okay? So understand this. If you want to back up the vehicle, those vehicles, in a perfect formation, the vehicle is in tune with exactly what you want, but you have to produce the image of the thing you want, which is to move the vehicle exactly the way you see other people move it. I show you, I go in and I show you the maneuver. You get out the vehicle and you attempt to do the same thing. But understand, I will not be able to move that vehicle unless in here, I already did it. So I'm producing something that I already created in my mind. I can go in more deeper and how to do that in, in, in later videos. But I can bring you more content. If you like it, support my channel. But understand this, it doesn't make a difference what school you're in. You apply our principles and you will be successful in any school that you're in. Remember, three levels of creation. Thought, ver words, and actually doing it. Think about the maneuver that you want to accomplish. Think about it perfectly. Talk about it. Say, I want this, I want that. And when you get behind the vehicle, produce the image implies, which is exactly what you want. And every maneuver will be successful. I guarantee you that. All right, this is Eddie Cruz for Truck and Masters. I'll come back with a little video. I'm gonna go more in details of how to produce the images. But understand that. It's not about the physical. Trucking is 99% mental, 1% physical. So work on the mental aspect of it. Leave all those videos alone on YouTube. Focus on this one. I guarantee you, you'll get more benefit with this video than the ones that you look at YouTube and telling you which way to turn the wheel. That's just, that's just stupid, okay? So, Trucking Masters, Eddie Cruz, I'll come back later with another video. You'll see, all right? I'll see you out there.